Check the mirrors and everything? Like yeah, I mean, you took the test 40 years ago, was it? <laughs> Something like that. That's my first <laughs> mean joke of the day. Ian Cole. Yes, ma'am. I know you've watched all the episodes with Envy, so we thought we'd finally let you be in Canucks and Cars. Yes, I'm actually a, uh, I'm a huge fan of Canucks and Cars. Yeah. I've been watching it for years. Uh, <laughs> long time viewer, first time rider. What do you think some of the, aside from winning championships, what are some of the highlights for you? World Juniors, my second World Juniors in Ottawa against Team Canada, like a New Year's Eve was just maybe the most like electric atmosphere I've ever been a part of. You're young, like you, you, the nerves affect you a lot more. Like I was just probably just sitting in there just like, <laughs> just like so anxious. Another cool thing that I read about, and, and you told me you would give us the whole story, <laughs> is flying with the Blue Angels. Yeah. So obviously your hockey career has afforded you some cool opportunities, but I've got to say, like I've got to guess, that, that is one of the most unique things of all time for someone to get to do because they play hockey. Yes, <laughs> yes, absolutely. It's crazy when you're making those turns and you're like, you know, doing all the tricks and the corkscrews and everything, like you just see your vision start to just go like black and it just starts to narrow and narrow. And then you like, you like squeeze as hard as you can and you take a little sip of air and you see it kind of like widen back out and like start to narrow again. It's like, and it starts to close. It was incredible the fabric of a championship winning team in your experience versus what you've experienced in Vancouver. Do you talk in the room about those things as a veteran when you get the opportunity with some of the younger guys? Yeah, absolutely. Are those like sidebars or is that, do you ever get up and speak? Yeah. How, does, how does that work? What do we not see? For me, it's much more like, hey, like forward X, like that track that you came back and you, you know, deflected this puck out of the middle to the side, like that made our job as D so much easier. Like that was great. Like keep doing that. Right. And like you do that and we'll win a lot of hockey games. I try to find certain things that like guys do well that I know like will translate either in their game or in our team game to like winning in the playoffs and winning when it matters and like really try to focus on those and say like, hey, this was really good or this really meant a lot and keep, please keep doing this. Like this was great. Um, and that's kind of like more how I kind of have those conversations. Is there anyone that we wouldn't think is funny that's actually kind of funny, whether they're actually funny or it's just like you watch them and you laugh? Like I think Nils Hoglander is so funny. And it's, he doesn't, like a, yeah, like he doesn't do. mean to be, but he's like, he cracks us up. He's so funny. What was the last movie you watched? Saltburn. I watched it on the plane the other day. It was a very wild movie, let's just say that. And we are going to go left when we can go left into the parking lot. Right up here? Yes. Okay. Check your blind spot, do all the, you know, all the stuff. Thanks. Thanks for a great Canucks and Cuts. Yeah, yeah, it was fun. Thank I you. I learned so much. <laughs>